around the United States about whether NFL stars should take a knee in defiance of Donald Trump to highlight the treatment of black Americans. In tonight's Views Night, Professor Kahinde Andrews says sports stars here should be doing the same. British sports stars should take a knee during the national anthem. After President Trump attacked NFL players who joined Colin Kaepernick's refusal to stand during the US national anthem, he sparked a wave of protest. The players stress that they are not protesting either the anthem or the flag, but racial injustice in America and their right to freedom of expression. But why not protest the flag? Racism is so deeply ingrained that it is part of the DNA of the nation. Britain is no different. The police may not kill as many black people, but is that only because they do not routinely carry guns? Every inequality of housing, employment, education and wealth that plagues African Americans is strongly felt by black people in Britain. All of this injustice is the direct legacy of the British Empire that often made its place in the world through genocide, slavery and colonialism. The Empire produced a toxic national identity, yet many people are yearning to roll back the clock to when Britannia ruled the world. So, Rather than draping themselves in the flag or tearing up during the anthem, British sports stars should take a knee or clench a fist. The flag is not a symbol of pride, but oppression. An anthem praising the monarch is not unifying, but divisive. A nation that will not deal with the realities of its racism is not one that the children of the colonies can feel part of. So, never again will I stand for the national anthem?